Hey everybody, this is Bob Cargill and I am here with Kate Suica from Avidia Bank. And Kate came over here to out of office in Hudson to meet with me and to shoot a little promo, if you will, for Avidia Bank and for Bob Cargill's Marketing Roadshow, which is on Friday, November 22, 3 to 8 p.m. Hope you guys are all planning to attend. Tickets can be had for only $25 on Eventbrite or hit me up or Kate up and we'll we'll point you in the right direction. But thanks Kate for a video bank sponsoring my event. And you and I just agreed before I turned on the camera to talk about social media, marketing, a little bit about what a video bank's up to. And, and I just wanted to start things off by, by saying what the theme of my roadshow is. And, and it is authenticity in marketing and how it's changed and, and how social media is so predominant and I think essential in today's day and age because it connects you with your your customers your clients your constituents and and traditional advertising isn't working like it used to people change the channel if they hear a commercial on the radio or on TV they not reading newspapers like they used to I don't think at all so it's all about digital marketing if you ask me and social media of course I'm biased that's what I do for a living but I'll let you take it from there meaning what do you think about transparency and marketing and what's going on today and, and tell us how Avidia Bank is 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 doing their marketing and branding and advertising. Sure, I think, uh, first of all, thanks for having me. This is super exciting and looking forward to the upcoming event. Um, but I Thank think you. authenticity <laughs> is so important for marketing and uh, social media and online channels really allow us to take advantage of that opportunity. And people do see really quickly, um, you know, what businesses are, uh, you know, working in good faith and legitimate and helpful to the community and that's a great way to showcase it. So, uh, you know, it's a really awesome opportunity for us as the bank to, to continuously show this off um, to our community. Tell me about, you mentioned uh, some kind of big campaign that's dropping on, on Monday. This is a Friday. I don't know if I'll post this video today, but this is Friday and, and over the weekend the little elves will be working and, <laughs> and on Monday morning your, your customers are going to see something new and different. What's that all about? Sure. Uh, we're actually looking, we did a whole brand research project and um, we're actually moving to uh, to actually work on essentially a rebrand, but a repositioning of ourselves in the market. And uh, actually when we became a video bank in 2007, we didn't really have the marketing dollars behind uh, our actual rebrand for the name of video. So now this was a great opportunity for us to go back and revisit this. Uh, and we did this after doing a lot of research. We looked at uh, what our customers think about us, what people in the community think about us, and also what our employees think about us and how they enjoy working at the bank. And that really helped us form who we are and what our brand is going to look like starting on Monday, September 23rd. I love that and it reinforces, underscores a point I'm always making with my clients and, and telling people, wh whoever will listen, frankly, that nowadays the, the customer is in control. I mean, all of that changed the consumer took took control when the internet came along and they started being able to connect with each other and talk about businesses and and businesses had to learn to join the conversation and ultimately do what you guys are doing it sounds like at video Bank Kate businesses have to listen to the customers the customers in control and and we can do all the marketing and if I'm speaking on behalf of clients marketing and advertising uh, telling it like it is how we think it should be but but ultimately we need to listen to the customers they're, they're, they're in charge the, the, the customer is always right as they say yeah a hundred percent I mean I think you know especially with the age of online marketing review sites that are out there you know it's not just being like told that it's a great product how we used to buy things right just oh it's a great product I saw it on television but you know you're seeing firsthand reviews on products and services and you know people are actually out there talking about those things and it's also easy to see through if people are uh, you know lying about them or, yes. or whatnot as well so I think I mean we're in a really cool era for marketing in that sense we, we are and it's it can be intimidating for some and I, I think certainly people who are accustomed to the same old same old traditional marketing tactics strategies etc but something you just said made me think you know branding I did a video on this branding is not what you say you are it's what your customers say you are so again you can put all the great logos colors splashy ads this and that out there but your customers it, it, it's how they respond to all that and ideally how you're branding yourself should mimic exactly what they want and expect from you 
Yeah, absolutely. And I think, you know, leveraging that too, and one of the things that I always share with, um, you know, people in different areas of marketing is like, leverage that. If customers are leaving you a really good review, if they are, yes. um, you know, sharing about your services, you know, first of all, reward them because they're doing a really awesome service for you and welcoming you into their network and that's an endorsement for them. But another thing is, you know, just sharing that with everybody else because those testimonials are extremely powerful. Totally agree. Okay, tell me about how people, if they were interested, how can they find you? How can they find Avidia Bank? Sure. Um, so Avidia Bank is based here in Metro West Massachusetts. We have 10 locations from Lemonster all the way out to Framingham. And you can visit them at avidiabank.com. Uh, we are also on social media on of Facebook course. and Twitter and Instagram. That wouldn't uh, be you behind the scenes, yeah. would it? <laughs> it might be. <laughs> and there might be a team, right? Yeah, there is a team as well. A few other uh, elves uh, <laughs> writing those 180 character long tweets and doing videos like this. Absolutely. <laughs> Um, and then if you want to follow me, you can follow me on social media, on Twitter and Instagram at BankSmartKate. Um, and of course, I'm on LinkedIn as well under Kate Suica. BankSmartKate, and she is wicked smart, <laughs> let me tell you. I met Kate, I think, first discovered you on social media. Yes, that's right. Yeah. And and it, it went kind of backwards, meaning, <laughs> you know, met, met Kate on, on social media, then found, oh, we both happened to graduate, have graduated from Leadership Metro West. Right. Me, just a billion years ago, Kate, like Stop. yesterday. <laughs> little bit of an age difference um, but we have that in common then we find out we have social media in common and and we live nearby and and look at now Kate in a video bank is sponsoring my first ever marketing roadshow I hope first of many mm -hmm. something different here uh, out of office I say here it's right down there just uh, about a hundred yards from here out of office co-working space in in Hudson Mass Friday November 22 3 to 8 p.m. you can get tickets on Eventbrite or again I told you hit up Kate hit up me anytime Thanks, Kate, for your time today. Yeah, thank you. This has been a really cool, impromptu video. And, and guys, we both, Kate and I, hope to see you at Bob Cargill's Marketing Roadshow, Friday, November 22, here at Out of Office in Hudson. Other than that, have a great day. Have a great time, whatever you're doing, wherever you are. Bye, guys.